All right, instantacres.com. This is the Mule Shoe Project. This is a, an awesome little uh, uh, rural development in Hickory County, Missouri, about 20 miles west of Lake of the Ozarks in Camdenton. We're looking at uh, the Little Niagara River, which flows directly through the conservation area, uh, northeasterly into the Lake of the Ozarks. There we go. Uh, so the conservation area is about 2,000 acres of public land. Uh, some of these tracks directly border the conservation area. They're all within a couple seconds um, of the conservation area and the river. As we look north, the tracks are on the right. The conservation area is on the left. Uh, we have fewer than 20 of these. I think there were 18 or 20 in the development. Um, they're going quickly. We'd like to, to, uh, to get them sold before hunting season with the hopes that uh, as people see... Uh, deer and turkey out here they'll send us some photos we we love to have those for our files uh, so we've, we've done a temporary price reduction here on the down payment so just 500 bucks here's a little map kind of showing what's going on here toward the lower left the purple um, backwards l you see that's the mule shoe project those are the tracks the peach area that it touches is the uh, actual conservation land looking to the right you've got the lake of the ozarks on the lower right you've got camdenton uh, so yeah quick quick drive to camdenton uh, just about 20 miles to the east uh, simply go down to uh, highway w go east to max creek and then take highway 54 east to camdenton so that's the main city at the lake of the ozarks uh, certainly for the southern part of the lake of the ozarks which you can see there um, the little niagara river even though it's not shown on this map uh, it would be if we had turned the the river layer on this is a map right map uh, but it goes right through that that peach colored conservation area which borders the tracks uh, goes northeasterly um, and then uh, uh, starts kind of where you see toward the middle of the screen where that where the lake starts to get larger that's where the uh, little niagara comes into it so uh, stunning tracks i mean hunting camping there's power uh, directly on quite a few tracks and it's nearby the others you've got county road frontage on all the tracks you've got mature timber a beautiful mixture of timber on all the tracks um, certainly can hunt certainly can camp certainly can build uh, check out the basic property covenants that really don't affect uh, most of the, the buyers on a track like this, uh, you can see those at instantacres.com. Um, just go to the website and uh, click on the Outcast Land tab, and uh, you're looking for the Mule Shoe Project. So if there are any tracks left, that's where you'll see them. Uh, like I said, we started with about 18. Um, we're looking down at the Little Niagara River, which is just seconds from the property. We flipped around now, and now as we look north... Um, Tracks are on the right side of that county road that's going straight north. And then the conservation area is on the left. We're also over the conservation area. Uh, so it, it's pretty awesome to have a, you know, a five or eight or 10 acre tract, uh, your own private acreage where you can set up shop, uh, hunt, you know, camp build, and have direct access into thousands of acres of public land. It's just kind of a, uh, a dream situation for a lot of hunters. Um, and with the, the river right there for fishing, for canoeing, for swimming, for kayaking, uh, you've got free public uh, campsites within the conservation area, which is great as well. Uh, if you want to come out and use your property recreationally, you don't want to necessarily, you know, create a large site, you do have the campground right there. So instantacres.com, that's it for the video. We hope to hear from you. Owner financing on everything on our website. These will go quickly. Uh, but yeah, go ahead to, to instantacres.com and uh, let us know if you have any questions.